Hello everybody, I'm Xavier Fritel, a gynecologist from Poitiers, France, and I am in charge of the VG Mesh Registry, and I will present you our result about pelvic organ prolapse surgeries. I have nothing to disclose. As you know, women have some concern about mesh safety, and clinical trials are not able to specify the risk of late or rare complication. In our registry, we collect information about surgeries and complications via surgeon reports, patient questionnaire, and hospital data linkage. Serious complications were defined as clavian dando grade three or more, for example, any reoperation for complication. During the last three years, we included in the registry 2,310 women with a surgery for pelvic organ prolapse. Around half of the surgery were done by laparoscopy using mesh with a sacropexy, and the other were transvaginal mesh or vaginal repair. You need to notice that women were different at baseline. And the woman with, who benefit from a vaginal procedure, vaginal repair or transvaginal mesh, were more often with an history of stress and urinary incontinence, an history of pelvic organ surgery, or an history of hysterectomy. We collected in the registry 50 complication leading in 16 cases to a mesh removal partially or totally. The main complication was mesh exposure. When you see the incidence of complication, it was around 1% for vaginal repair and laparoscopic sacropexy and around 4% for transvaginal mesh. Taking into account the difference, the difference at baseline between the, the woman, we found that transvaginal, transvaginal mesh increase the risk of complication by four and laparoscopic sacropexy by two. Considering the risk of pelvic organ recurrence. It was similar in the transvaginal mesh group and in the laparoscopic sacropexy group, but it was increased around 6% in case of vaginal repair. Taking into account the difference between the woman, the two groups using mesh shows that they decrease the risk by a factor of four as you can see here. About health perceived by the woman, a large part of the women consider themselves as very much better or much better since the surgery, and they rated their health as very good or good for, all, for more than 70% of uh, our sample. And this perceived health was better than expected in the French population of the same age. To conclude, complication and recurrence were uncommon. Complication risk was lower in case of vaginal repair, but in the other end, recurrence risk was higher in case of vaginal repair. It seems like laparoscopy sacropexy presents the best profile in terms of medium-term benefit risk. The VEGMICE registry is still ongoing. We wish to precise late complication, symptoms including pain, and recovery after complication. I need to thank all the women and the hundred, the hundred of surgeons who participate in our registry. Goodbye, everybody. Have a good day.